everyone this is babbles here just coming to you with another video this one uh, is a collab with the we love collab group on facebook i want to thank them for tagging me for this particular video this is the pet tag and i will include a playlist in the description box below showcasing everyone that has joined this collab and after watching my video, please click the link below in the description box, as I said, to watch everyone that participated. Now, um, if you're new, welcome to my channel. Please stick around, hit the subscribe button, hit the little bell so that you can get the alerts to when we upload. We typically upload on Mondays and Thursdays. Um, but anyways, on to the video. Okay, so the first question is, what is your pet's name? My pet's name, uh, there are two of them. Um, actually, we have a lot of pets, but we've already introduced Mr. Bumbles in another video. And the uh, other two aren't cooperating right now. So, uh, we're just going to focus on our discus fish for this particular video. And uh, one is named Blue, and one is named Kai. And then the second question is, what kind of pet is it and what breed? These are freshwater, tropical, fish and they are in the cichlid variety um, and then it says how long have you had your pet friend I have actually only had them a few months um, but I love them as if I had them forever but I've actually only had them a few months and then the fourth question is how did you get your pet I actually flew out to California this is a crazy story I I follow this guy on YouTube called DIY oh no the king of DIY his name is Joey and I've been a fan of his for years and I bought his book and I wanted to get it signed and he was having a meet he actually lives in Canada and he was doing a meet in California and so I was like you know what my sister was out there and we go visit her and go and meet you know this guy that I'm obsessed with and get my book signed and I went to um, he was there to um, meet the this owner called Uncle Sam's Discus. Uh, I forget the owner's name. I think it's Wes. Meet Wes. Um, and Wes had just his discus fish had just won uh, a, a, a championship. So he's a champion discus. And so everyone wanted to go and meet this particular fish. I just wanted to meet Joey. But when I went there, Uncle Sam's they had uh, so many beautiful discus fish um after you're done watching this video uh you definitely want to look up this fish if you've never heard of them they're kind of rare um they're uh more known in asian uh, countries uh, and i think they're from the amazon river if i uh, if i'm remembering correctly i have so many tropical fish but um these fish are known to be found in the amazon river and they're prevalent in asian countries but I got them at Uncle Sam's Discus, and um, when I saw them, I just had to have them. I did not go there to get them, but I just had to have them. They were so beautiful. Uh, and um, they, the fish that I have, they can get up to, I think, 8 to 10 inches if they're taken care of very well. It's rare to see them at 10 inches, but um, most likely they'll get to be 8. So almost dinner plate size. They're huge, you guys. They're so big. I think mine's are about 5 inches. Uh, maybe 4.5, four and a half inches, and but they're just so much bigger in person. You can't tell how big they are on camera on this video, but they're they're big. They're about the size of my actual hand. Um, and then the fifth question is, how old is your pet? I am not sure how old they are because when I purchased them from Uncle Sam, he didn't tell me, you know, when they were born. So I'm not sure, but just from size, I would think they were less than a year, just under a year old. Um, what are some quirky things about your pet's personality? Well, discus or um, uh, do something very rare in the in you know the fish aquarius you know uh, society. They are, well, they do something rare that most fish don't do, but it's not so rare in cichlids. Is that they actually feed their young off of uh, secretions from their skin, so it actually looks like the babies are eating the skin off right off the bodies of the uh, parents it is not really their skin something that comes off their skin but they can while they're nibbling at it take some of their skin and scales off so they can get weak so they have to take a break and so they actually will do this crazy move where the parent will get right next to the other parent and like dart away 
So then <laughs> they move so fast that the fish babies just sit there shocked and confused. And then they just end up on the other parent that's still sitting in the area. I mean, they do a lot of things that other fish don't do. They definitely have a bigger personality than my other fish. So that's why I, I tend to enjoy them a little bit more than my other tropical fish. Because my other fish just beg for food. These ones actually have a personality. They actually do things in the tank. And um, I don't know. They're just cool. Um, and then the next question is what does your relationship with your pet mean to you um I don't know they're still kind of new I just love watching them they actually make me feel calm like if I'm ever stressed out or just need to just you know calm down or get my mind focused on one thing because I just got so many things going on uh, I would just go and just sit and watch them and it's just so calming just to watch the fish tank and just watch them swim back and forth and they're just so pretty and they're in their own little world i don't know i just love it um and i actually started a channel for these particular fish because they're kind of a popular fish so um i'll link that channel to uh, to Blue and Kai below if you're in interested at all in watching them or if you just need a relaxing moment for yourself and just want to watch some fish you can watch Blue and Kai they love it so I will like I said I will link their channel below this is a brand new channel so I don't have much I have a ton of questions on there a ton of comments but I don't have a lot of, lot of uh, subscribers yet but I, I didn't make the channel for that so I'm not worried about it it's just that people subscribe and they subscribe but I just put videos on there just because I am part of another forum a fish forum uh, actually a discus forum in particular and in order to uh, share the videos I have to share a YouTube link so I started their YouTube channel just to share the videos with my uh, discus forum so uh, but anyways I'll link that channel below and then it says what are some of your favorite pastimes with your pet I don't have any pastimes with my pet yet um, and then what are the nicknames that you call your pet I mean they only have one syllable name so I can't really give them a nickname um, but I just know that I care about these fish a lot I did a lot of research before I got them because these particular fish are rare like I don't even know of anyone even selling it in my area and then when I go to talk about this people in this area never even heard of this fish and I have to show them pictures of it and they're amazed um as far as like freshwater tropical fish they usually do not come in that many different colors and they usually aren't this large of a size. I mean, unless you get like an Oscar or some other sickly varieties that, that get a little large. But typically they're not colorful too, though. They're usually just silver or gray or black, you know. Uh, but with the discus, they come in like, uh, got like 30 different colors, maybe even more. Uh, and I will link some other of the disc, some other discus colors and breeds and strains at the end of uh, this video. So you can just see if you're ever interested. If you have any questions about them, please let me know. Put them in the comments. I will answer, happily happily answer any questions you have about the discus fish because I know a lot of people probably never even heard of them. Um, and I guess that's it. I hope you enjoyed this video. I'm going to cut it right here because I don't want this video to be too long for the pet tag. Um, hope you enjoyed it. If you're new, again, please subscribe. Uh below share like comment everybody thank you for watching have a good day bye